My name is Raul Rodriguez. I'm a barber. I do consider myself an entrepreneur or an entrepreneur as well. So I call me with the words barber, entrepreneur. It really just represents the journey of learning and developing skills. I mean, really just, it, it came to me naturally. Uh, I've always been into the creative space of art. And um, just over time, I've seen myself lining myself up. I remember the first time I went, I was like, yeah, this nigga hell is ghetto. Because <laughs> <laughs> the area, bro, I was like, bro. <laughs> I started in the garage um, the first time my boy actually came over to get a cut. I asked my mom if it was okay, you know, that he comes through and um, it just kind of became a routine thing to where she just knew I was, you know, trying to actually do something. So she actually let me convert that whole space to my own and I kind of just went from there. Uh, I really gravitated towards it. So it was just, it was always around me. And once I picked it up and really kind of tried it for myself and tried it for others is when I started to develop, uh, develop more of like that, that passion for it. Early morning, pray to God that we okay. Another day around the sun, another chance to get this cake. Yeah, I see a lot of love and I see a lot of hate. And it's got forsaken place, but I know we gonna be straight cause we all live. It's been four years, I'm 22 now. So I started 18, 19. If I just trust the process and believe in myself a thousand percent, what can stop me? Boy J. Fade, he was actually a barber local downtown. And I visited him a couple weeks into me actually beginning to cut hair. Super inspirational. He actually gave me some materials myself. Uh, gave me a lot of advice when it comes to cutting hair and how to attack the game. We stayed in connect from there and then uh, eventually actually did do a one-on-one -on -one mentorship which really led to a lot of success. The with... thing you can do in this life, lesson number two, is show up every single day. I'm pushing the line, my shoes designed, and I don't wanna fuck it with you in the condom. I'm a fresh ass nigga with a check on hand. I like girls from Oakland, but I'm a Frisco man. Hold on. I mean, I specialize in more tight gradual or a tight transition phase rather than a gradual stretch phase. Work support's been solid. Um, everyone, you know, they uh, really just have a lot of trust and, and faith in me more than I can say myself sometimes. And it's pretty dope that, you know, they, they'll recognize that in me. When they affirm that to me, it's, it's cool because at times I feel like, you know, we, we all feel like we need to be doing something bigger. So when we hear something from, uh, you know, a close friend or family or anything like that, then we also feel like, you know, it, it's affirmed. Well, the more, if you look at it as a chart, like a graph, the more I'm determined, the more success I have. So I aim to point in that direction as much as possible, knowing that I'll go up as much as possible.